Philip Binks here. Discarding your opponent's hand has always been a really flawed archetype in Marvel Snap. A lot of the cards you have to play discard your own cards, which kind of, you know, who does that help more? And, you, you know, everything just kind of costs a lot and is a little bit underpowered. But I tried to take the deck to the absolute limit with a deck I call the Hand Deleter. So the goal of this deck is to completely delete your opponent's hand and then use that advantage of them not being able to really do their game plan uh, and just win off the back of some really awesome things. Uh, so we have Zabu in here and then our four drop package is Wong to get double discards against our opponent. Absorbing Man to copy a discard from our opponent. Uh, we have Proxima Midnight, which is great if it gets discarded in our own hand, uh, be it through our own Blade or through Silver Samurai. Uh, and Silver Samurai is really nice at targeting your opponent's cards. Uh, it can have a little bit of tension with some of these other cards here, but uh, usually if you're just deleting one card for your hand and one card for your opponents, you're hoping that uh, you, you can get over the top. Ghost Rider was an interesting addition I added a little bit late. I think that it is really solid. You know, if you discard a Doom or a Black Bolt, you can get it. Sometimes you can do some really cheeky Blade Ghost Rider combos with things. Uh, Swarm is also here to kind of absorb any discards on your side to turn them into benefits for you uh, we have stature to get a huge discount and then doom is really great because we can kind of get into a position where we played out pretty much all of our hand discarded some stuff uh, we have Wong down and then we can just play doom Wong to finish out and our opponent maybe only has one or two cards left and that huge power swing can just uh, completely overtake the game uh, now overall this deck isn't amazing i don't think any opponent hand discard stuff is going to be great unless you're like just throwing stature black bolt as the top end uh, but we had a lot of fun with it we had about a 45 percent win rate and we lost some cubes but uh, this deck is is a highlight fest and a lot of fun so again a flawed archetype uh, no deck you're going to make like this is going to be great but if you're trying to play Play this archetype and have a lot of fun this deck is for you as always if you're enjoying this content make sure to hit the like button check down below make sure you subscribe catch you live at twitch.tv slash banks underscore plays enjoy you peace with new york maybe we could do some work on this nebula hold it at bay get moon knight going We get swarm here. It'd be nice to just discard this swarm, but just take our moon knight. Who's black bolt that hurts? Lars hurts them too. Honestly, rude. Uh, we can get black bolt back though. Snap. Snaps on us here. I'm not that worried. Order? Ah, yeah, that's a good point. No, what? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Good point. Order, order, order. Mm. Still have to win right. Mm. It's tough. Can't fulfill. Fulfilling loses immediately. Got a Nihilus here. That would suck. But, I mean, we're, we're playing with house money at this point anyway, right? Plus three, right? Keep left. They might move Nebula thinking that we don't go here. We can move a lot of stuff here, though. Cannonball coming right. Do we do Psycho play around Cannonball? Move the rock. Let them Cannonball with my Black Bolt left. That would truly be Psycho. <laughs> Thank you, chat, for that one. <laughs> There's certainly locations that exist in the game. Favorite four cost card that's underrated. My favorite four cost card that is underrated. My favorite four cost card that's underrated. Um, I would say crossbones, but now that crossbones, crossbones is kind of weak now. Hopefully um, they they have the miss here. I, I mean, who knows what the hell is going to happen, right?
They have a lot of energy, but they're going to have no cards. Crossbones is rated correctly, though. Drax is probably kind of a sneaky pick right now at a 4-9. Game? Hello, game? All the energy in the world, but, but will you have anything to play? Is the question. Stagron? Stagron's pretty mid, man. Opponent snapped. They have to play the null out now. Otherwise I I eat it. <laughs> Oh, nice. They probably have no one death left in hand. Enough said, Bub. Enough said, Bub. Big death. Scary Eliath. Winning is not easy, though. Just a top deck, right? They're just fighting their top deck, and it's not... It could be Null. One in four that it's Null. Null just crushes us. Wait, this actually... This is... This is more... Um... They have to hit Null. Nice. Oh, very scary, very scary, very scary indeed. They get to where, like, our Loki and can disrupt us, we, we could be in some trouble, but... I mean, we're gonna quadruple discard them, right? So... They'll, they'll, be, they'll be having some issues. Look at that, Black Bolt. They did have one of my disruptive cards. You love Rouge? Rouge is good. I could rouge my Wong and put us in some trouble, but we still get to discard a lot. Change wave preemptively before Mobius was released to prevent that combo. You know, I, I hate Mobius though. Mobius is like one of my least favorite cards in the whole game. Or still get over top of that, and we make your dinosaur suck ass. Where did my cards go? Very good question. Where did your cards go? Uh, if they have random, like, a Lyoth, <laughs> this would suck. <laughs> we do lose to random Eliath. Whatever. Mobius, it's just when it's popular, it, like, makes a bunch of decks not worth playing, and I don't like that. Don't be Eliath. Okay. My cards! Three Black Bolts that game, chat. A very Black Bolt centric game. Victory. We have been getting a lot of Comartage, which helps, helps with the deck a lot. Icebox on that, that's fine. We get our Moon Knight down. Start working on our opponent's hand. Is this make your opponent rage quit day? It, it does lead to some rage quits. People get pretty upset. Okay, let's try and get their Null. Their Null would be the best hit, almost certainly. Their death is great, too. Maybe we probably can take a snap on this. Maybe discard. Plus the Zabu. Random card or lowest card? It would either be Wong or Null for us, but it almost certainly um, Null for them. Let's snap on them. Probably can't get too much power middle. So eight should be enough to get us over top. We also have Doom, which is great. That could have hit your Null, brother. Man, both missed their Null? That's crazy. Both of those missing their Null is, is absolutely insane. What have we lost now? Wongers? Hmm. 
Ghost Rider's not great. I think we just taken another Absorbing Man trigger and then we try and finish with um, our Doom. Yeah, really bad luck there. We get their Null though. Now they're just top decking. That's top deck a pretty big card to win left. Then this will win us middle. Uh, what would be left in their deck? A Killmonger, maybe? To try and get to middle, but I, th I think we're just fine. Crazy to go for Forge there. The Doom catches a lot of people off guard. The Doom catches a lot of people off guard. Victory. Eliath, some, some discard decks, or some destroy decks are on Eliath, but pretty rare. Uh, so as you can see, like, the deck kind of, like, fumbles its way through a lot of times. You're, like, discarding a lot of your own cards, but uh, it, it can work, man. It can work. I also have a affinity for Paul Giamatti, or uh, for uh, John Leguizamo, because I watch a podcast oh, where they watch everything Thanks, that he's man. ever done. Let's try him on the raft. If you get any kind of discardy stuff, we could be in a good spot. You could also blade Ghost Rider to win there. Ghost Rider would give us two. We would delete everything. We would delete our whole hand. Do I want to delete my whole hand? It's the worst that could happen, right? Uh, this is a bit wrong card to play. Make sure you don't accidentally discard the new card. Oh, it will, won't it? A great point. Shit. I mean, I don't know how we do this without deleting the card that we get. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. No, then we don't want to use Ghost Rider. Ah! Oh, it's Apocalypse! Fog! <laughs> Isn't that a beaut? Victory. <laughs> yeah, we got our Wongers into Samurai. Get to delete their entire livelihood. Guardian set from the other night, carry to infinite, the lockdown one, it's good. Five, five, six, discard two, yeah. Five, six, discard two would be a lot of fun. Might be too strong though. Okay, it's good that they're ahead. Oh, they put things back into their hand, like destroy a lot of stuff. Maybe seeing a lot of deleted messages by butt. Don't, don't hurt butt. What do you ever do to you? Uh, wait, this card's Doom. That sucks. Eh, whatever. This card's their whole hand, too, and that's funny. a top deck battle for the ages. What just happened? I deleted your whole ass hand, you piece. They probably have a Deadpool in hand that's only one. It's either double attack one lane or single attack two. Let's go. Sometimes, sometimes, even if it's bad for you, it's probably worse for your opponent, right? Mr. Star kind of feels so good. <laughs> I do think Mobius just, uh, while I can see for the long term why it might be good to have a control valve like that, I think it is, makes the game worse when Mobius exists. 
It's more when Mobius is popular. I think the game is significantly worse. None of my cards do anything, man. I have a Proxima hangout, right? It's carding your own Dracula. Try to get their Hella. So negative instantly dead forever. Ugh. I am reborn. I'm always to be more stable. I mean, obviously, it was way worse at two costs, and it's not, it's not as bad at three costs, but. Hey. We'll have to figure out a way to win, though, right? They still have to win these other lanes. Oh, and Apoc weird. Eh, there's several decks that run it with, like, Dracula and stuff. Like, if we can win the other two lanes, we're fine. They can just play Apocalypse right, but... We could just win left and middle, right? How do these augment in any way? They just play APOC, we win. Their other two cards have to beat us left and middle. Isn't super easy. Could happen though. Moist well, doesn't check until Mockingbird. Uh, no, before Mockingbird, it was still in that main Thanos deck. Chat! Another discard deck down. Look at that. Victory. Did you look at that? <laughs> what does one do here? Snap? It's an option. They turn Doom turn six. What if they just beat me right? Then I just lose. How can I get proximal land middle? I can't, right? I don't think I can get proximal in middle, right? Ah, Blade, Ghost Rider. Doesn't get Proxima, but it helps. Left! Yes! Ooh. Well, they don't play APOC? APOC shouldn't matter, right? How do they ever get middle? Let's go! Tactical victory! Yeah, the problem with playing Modok middle, which is the problem I had too, why I couldn't just like try and get to blading it, is that um, because the blade is still active, it counts for your points and then it goes left. I think we want to leave this. Eh, we we'll probably play this here. I was going to say, we might want to leave this empty for Proxima reasons, but. There's. We don't even have Proxima in hand. We could do some funky Ghost Rider stuff if we want eventually. Okay, if we get like a swarm or something, we're in a great spot. Yeah, whatever. We will choose to vibe. If we don't get a swarm, we're in a lot of trouble. Right. 
Now we go full hand delete. I don't know how crazy we go, though. I think the less chances we have to hit Black Bolt stuff, the better. So let's just fill our hands to the to the brim. Uh, even though the Swarms will cost two, it's like fine. So next turn we just play Black Bolt right and then delete the rest of his hand. And then maybe lose? I don't, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Well, uh, Kamertage and Onslaught Citadel are the same. I hate that stupid Mobius fan. They might think like, oh, what are you doing? That's nothing. And then we say, ha ha, but I'm killing your cards too, you piece. Just don't discard my Black Bolt, please. Nice Magento. Nice Blob. Very scary. It was even Time Stoned. Why would you use it? You should use it. And then we just get the quadruple doom just just to just to make it hurt even worse. Please hold the card in your hand. Please, please hold the card in your hand. Please hold on to that card for dear life. Oops, sorry, huh? Probably was so good here. Nice Mobius. Okay, we got Zabu and a Samurai. Hopefully you not knock out our Swarma. I'm the OG in the Snap community? Yeah, I mean, I'm one of them for sure. I was a day one-er. I feel like a lot of people get the vibe. It's Samurai into Abs, man, which is quite nice. Yeah, the War Machine will be a lot of fun. War Machine Vid will be a lot of fun. Okay, this is probably, um... Probably Tribunal. But we can sneak their, um... We can get their, like, uh, Mystiques. We can get their Iron Men. Very good, very good stuff coming out here. Probably just Snap on this. Like, deleting their hand is so good. They can play Iron Man this turn, and they might choose to if they're smart. Oh, it's C3. C3. Let's keep the swarms in hand. Like, it's good to hit the Proxima, but... I'll just keep the swarms in hand. Actually, I really want to hit the Proxima, if I'm being honest with you. I really want a good chance to hit the Proxima. I don't care if the Ghost Rider dies. Ghost Rider kind of sucks. With the swarm. The Sean. Keep the assault. Keep the assault going. Just play the Proxima from hand next turn. Opponents shaking in their boots. <laughs> I just keep deleting their cards. They they don't know what to do. They're panicking. It's Proxima, yeah, Proxima's great. Uh, you could replace it with Wolverine, but it's it makes it a lot worse. They have to top deck the Cerebro, it's a one and three. 
Trooper was plus six here. Plus six here. We can get plus six. Yeah, we're, we're fine. The only thing we're scared of is top deck Cerebro, and this beats it, right? Cerebro, this goes to 15. We're getting to 15. This goes to, again, 15. We get to 14, but then we win right by a ton. They have a one drop, they didn't draw one. Victory. Okay, we got to 10. They would have won tiebreaker for sure. I think. Well, maybe it was closer than I thought. Double on reveals. Great for us. Happy with my snap. They might be discard though, so... Now, now that I see the collector, it feels a lot worse. I do, I do tell you what. Yeah, 110 blade's pretty good. Why is the 6 so small? Is that crazy? Yeah, it looks like Loki. Loki's a lot better for us. I uh, hope you didn't want your hand. It would be a shame if you did. Now we can just go Silver Samurai middle, Black Bolt middle, and then just do double Doom. And play a Swarm left. Swarm right. Okay, they're adding cards as fast as I can delete them. Which kind of sucks, but I digress. But we will we will keep the pressure on and we will keep deleting your cards. They tried Loki here, they only get three because they're gonna do another double discard. Should be in a pretty good spot here. We just doom doom swarm right to finish, get a ton of points on the board. Left might be a bit of an issue, but we're winning middle pretty handedly. We're gonna be winning right pretty handedly. Really just depends on what they play here. It was, so it was a full tie, that's crazy. Didn't realize that we were even that close left. I just thought with the coal and the mockingbird, we would be down by like an insane amount. I guess we were playing like medium sized cards. Okay. By hand. Do Loki for only two cards. They could get Doom, but I think our Doom will beat theirs. Insanely rude of you, I'm not gonna lie. This probably wins. I don't think they can get 14 middle with my cards. I don't really know what they could play right to get this much. Play it out though. They only get two of our cards, which is nice. Nice! Another win! Bigs. 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 I hope you like the vibe. Bigs. Bigs. Like and subscribe. and subscribe.